please allow me to read a few scriptures. Bible verse Psalm 5 to 3. Hear my cry for help, my King and my God, for to you I pray. In the morning, Lord, you hear my voice in the morning, I lay my requests before you and wait expectantly. Dear Heavenly Father, help me remember what a difference it makes when I make time with you awry orally in my morning. Awaken me in body and spirit each day with a desire to meet with you and to hear you speak words of affirmation, assurance and wisdom over my heart as I prepare to go into my day. God said in Psalm 143, 8, Let the morning bring me word of your unfailing love, for I have put my trust in you. Show me the way I should go, for to you I entrust my life. You have brought me to the beginning of a new day. As the world is renewed fresh and clean, so I ask you to renew my heart with your strength and purpose. Forgive me the errors of yesterday and bless me to walk closer in your way today. This is the day I begin my life anew. Shine through me so that every person I meet may feel your presence in me. Take my hand, precious Lord, for I cannot make it by myself. Another Bible verse Psalm 118.24 This day belongs to the Lord. Let's celebrate and be glad today. Psalmist says this is the day that the Lord has made and I will rejoice and be glad in it. I place today in your hands, Father, I will rejoice and I will be glad today because your grace and your peace and the blessings of protection that you offer are with me always, Father, I claim your word that says surely goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life. I plead the blood of Jesus over my life today, over my spirit, my soul and my body. I plead the blood of Jesus over everything in my life. Life. I submit all that may trouble me into your hands. I place my fears, anxiety and worries into your hands. This is another day, O oh Lord, and I don't know what it will bring. I come before you, O oh Lord. As the sun rises, may your hope rise up in me. As the birds sing, may your love flow out of me. As the light floods into this new day, May your joy shine through me. I come before you, O Lord, and drink in this moment of peace, that I may carry something of your hope, love, and joy today in my heart. I don't know what today holds, but I am confident that you are a faithful God who will see me through you will direct my steps this day into the way of peace and strength, and my heart will obey your Command, steady my emotions. Father, stay beside me through this day. Keep watch over me. Send your angels to have charge over me. Jesus, you are my redeemer. You are the good shepherd, the shepherd that makes me to lie down in green pastures, the shepherd that led me beside the still waters, strengthened my faith and helped me to face this day with you. Help me to stand up bravely in faith. Father, let me be of clear mind today. Give me clarity in my mind so that I may make good decisions today. Help me not to be confused in any area for your word says that you are not the author of confusion. Fight for me today, Lord. Protect me from any storms that can bring fear, any challenges that may cloud my judgment or try and create confusion that is not my portion, Lord. Help me, Lord, to have the mind of Christ. You have not given me a spirit of fear or of confusion, but you have given me a spirit of power, love, and a sound mind. I choose this day to set my mind and my heart on your word. I ask that you would help me to meditate on your word day and night, and I thank you that you are a God who is true to his word. Father, help me to let go of yesterday. Help me to forgive and to begin again. Help me to trust your plan today. God helped me to see new beginnings. Help me to heal from the pain of yesterday. Help me to start over because I know that you have better 
plans for me, Lord. I exalt your name, King Jesus. You are the chief cornerstone of my life. I pray that you show me the way in which I should go today. Your words as the steadfast love of the Lord never ceases. His mercies never come to an end. They are new every morning. Great is your faithfulness. I thank you, Lord, for victory over sin and death. All of my steps today, Father, may the blood of Jesus protect me. I will not be afraid of anything that comes my way because everything is in your hands. I invite you to walk with me, Lord. May the Holy Spirit guide me, lead me, and speak to me. I set my eyes and my affections on heaven. I look to you, Lord, the author and finisher of my faith, your word says that you will keep me in perfect peace when my mind stays on you and i come to you today i ask that you renew my mind as i meditate on your word i ask that you would bring peace into my heart and into my mind and silence every confusing voice from the enemy let nothing affect me all my family because the blood of Jesus Christ will fall a protective barrier and nothing from the enemy and no weapon formed by the enemy shall prosper against me. I let go of anything that cannot remain under the blood of Jesus, any old habits, any sinful habits, any impure thoughts, any negative people. I choose to remain covered by the blood of Jesus Christ and I claim the protection, the provision and direction that comes from being covered by the blood of Jesus. Jesus, I come before you today, knowing that all power is in your hands. I know, and I have confidence that you are a God that cares for your people. And I place my trust in you. I place every situation that I face today into your care. My life is in your hands. I surrender every relationship, every thought. I surrender every concern and worry that. I have to you, Father, take every doubt, every fear, every depressing emotion, take everything, Lord, and I ask that you release your grace and mercy. I ask that you release your power from heaven to lead me and guide me, fill me with your Holy Spirit. Give me spiritual eyes to see, Lord, and ears to hear, so that I may not fall for the attacks of the enemy. I lay my life down at your feet, and I bring all of my desires, all of my ambitions, and all of my dreams before you. Everything I long for, everything that I love and hold. I come before you, O Lord. As the sun rises, may your hope rise up in me. As the birds sing, May your love flow out of me. As the light floods into this new day, may your joy shine through me. I come before you, O Lord, and drink in this moment of peace, that I may carry something of your hope, love, and joy today in my heart. God help me to keep my heart pure and undivided focused on you father protect me from my own careless thoughts words desires and deeds lord keep me from being distracted and discouraged by the enemy but i pray father that your holy spirit may fill me and guide me today lord may nothing separate me from you today teach me how to choose only your way today so each step will lead me closer to you Help me walk by the Holy Spirit and not my feelings. Help me to keep my heart pure and undivided. Protect me from my own careless thoughts, words and actions. And keep me from being distracted by my wants, my desires, my thoughts on how things should be. Help me to embrace what comes my way as an opportunity, rather than a personal inconvenience. And finally, Help me to rest in the truth of Psalm 86 13. Great is your love toward me. You already see the ways I will fall short and mess up. But right now, I consciously tuck your whisper of absolute love for me into the deepest part of my heart. I recognize your love for me is not based on my performance. You love me, warts and all. That's amazing. But what's most amazing is that the Savior of the world would desire a few minutes with me this morning. Lord, help me to forever remember what a gift it is to sit with you like this. Lord, help me to live this day quietly, easily, 
to lean on your great strength, trustfully, restfully, to wait for the unfolding of your will, patiently, serenely, to meet others, peacefully, joyfully, to face tomorrow. Dear Lord, I pray that you would give me strength to be strong for you in the world today. Lord, you know the struggles that I will face today. Be with me as I go through them. Carry me if I am too weak to move. If I stumble in them, forgive me, Father. When I succeed in them, I will praise you. You are worthy of all praise and honor. I thank you for hearing my prayer. I thank you for answering my prayer. I decree and declare that I have victory today in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. God bless you.